Hello everyone, I'm back with part 2 of I the Somnium Files. Are you guys super excited? Oh my god, the first part already. I'm like, I have so many ideas of what possibly could be happening. I'm gonna go through the game more and see what happens. Go through the game and, you know, let's have some fun. <laughs> oh, look at Boss. Up on her little table. It's weird, it's weird seeing Date here, you know, because, like, I know, I know Date from, like, the first game, so, he has, like, this fruit. Alright, Date, what you got to say? Oh, wait, no, let's continue looking at the room. Um, desk. What, she's not gonna say anything about the desk? Floating ring. Stationary. I think I got... I think I got everything. I think. It's just way too much stuff in the room. Every time I go through this game, I'm like, oh my god. Do I have to like look at every single thing again and again and again? Alright. Um yeah, let's talk. Ooh. I found out what that rug actually costs, by the way. Something like 500 million yen. Oh that's, that's true. true. I confiscated it from a thief. Are you allowed to do that? My boss can do anything. She's like above the law. Five hundred million yen. How much is that in like USD? Alright, <laughs> About your face, yes. Let's ask him about the eye patch. Wait, where is Iba? Why isn't Iba in his eye? Hmm? Is there something on my face? Well, the face you have now. Wait, what did I miss? Real faces. Wait, wait, wait. You got your old body back during the new. Cyclops Sierra King's case, so okay, yeah. 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 Well, I decided to have a custom mask made. Wait, we have a. Everyone knows me by this face. <gasps> no, but his body was different. He was like more bulky. So he had like a. F is he is he actually using a face mask for this? Besides. This one is, uh, more popular with the ladies. Dude, but you're supposed to be with, um... What's it? Or what's her name? A Aset's mom. What was it Hitomi? What happened to Hitomi? I don't think it makes much of a difference. Shut up! <laughs> it's weird! I, like, the fact that I know that he's, um... I forgot what his name was. Falcon? Well, I know, well, he had his... Like, actual name. I don't remember what it was, but like it was Falcon. Um, the fact that I kind of know the ending, how it goes, and that he's supposed to be Falcon, it's, it's weird because I, now I associate this face with evil. <laughs> I don't know. By the way, Jin Fui didn't have a silicone mask on. I know because I x-rayed it. Ah. Interesting. Okay, good information. <laughs> it's just so confirming awesome. that um that dude is still the same dude from like 6 years and now. So, I'm wearing the patch because Iba ran away from home. Iba ran away from home. That's not the whole story though, is it, Don? You tried to watch a VR video of bikini girls spitting <gasps> watermelons on the beach. No. Or Iba. I can't do this anymore. I am done being your partner. No wonder Iba moved on to Mizuki. So Iba leapt out of Date's eye socket and ended up at my place. So she's at your house right now? <clears throat> no, she's working on a top secret mission. What mission? If I told you, it wouldn't be top secret. <laughs> Uh, right here. I thought you were on vacation. Yeah, new labor laws. I'm supposed to be on break. Oh. And why are you here? Well, why not? I was bored, so I thought I'd come play darts. This is supposed to be a place of business. Could you not play around in here? What? This room is full of things to play with. She. <laughs> I miss. I miss Date. He, he. I mean, he. His humor was so good. Now I gotta figure out what his name was. That was it.
Falco. It was Falco, but his real name was... Um... Oh, give me the spoiler. Um... Do, do, do. Why is it so hard to find his name? So... Okay, that didn't give me anything. It's not Kaname Date. Hayato Yagyu, that's, that's what it is. Hayato Yagyu, okay. I mean, that takes a better name, but still, I kind of, I kind of, like, just remember Hayato Yagyu, and his voice was so good. Why, why are we having Date's voice? I mean, I mean, if he has a mask, doesn't, isn't his voice supposed to be of, like, Hayat, Hayato? Like, I don't know, that makes no sense to me. I saw the news last night. I talked to Boss earlier, too, so I know the gist of what's going on. A corpse suddenly appeared in the middle of a live stream, right? For some reason, just the right half. Ouch. Like it traveled through time and space. Oh, this was... Yeah, this is six years prior. And we are Ryuki. Okay. Advice? I only give advice when I'm drinking. Shall we? <laughs> Not even new oh yeah, we're gonna go to... Um... Mama's? I think? What was the Mama's bar? <laughs> Who cares? I'm on vacation. Well, I'm not. Come on. My tree. Is Wait, is he above 21? No, I'll just handle this myself. What? Drink with me. Is he is he actually? Uh no. Uh oh, there it is. File. I want to know how old these people are now. Six years ago. Present. Ooh, we have two files. Mizuki is 18. Wait. Okay. He is 29? He does not look 29. He looked 21. Hey. Oh, yeah. He has two color eyes. I forgot about oh yeah because of her Tama. 49 boss is 49 that's insane she don't even look 49 she looks the same when she was six years ago he looks 43 okay what about us oh yeah we're we're unknown still uh wait 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 I'm so curious. Boss? Boss is 43 and still looks the same. Or they just used the same photo. I mean, we were in both timelines, so we know what each one looks like. Iris, that's her name. I was thinking of Aset. Aset, you bet. Alright. Um... Okay, let's talk to... Oh, it's a real cozy bar in Omiya I know about. <laughs> All the bartenders are sexy women, aren't they? <laughs> Oh, is it the sea something? How did you know? And why Omiya of all places? You don't know? Saitama is hot right now. <laughs> it's warm at this time of year? That's not what I meant. Oh no. Uh, Saitama is a province located north of Tokyo. With a population of around 7 million. Omiya was the capital of Saitama. Is top of bullet trains, blah blah blah. Johnny's groups perform. Tons of stores. That's in my light. Omiya is a really fashionable city. Okay, good to know. Senior agent that day. Tama boss. Let's go Tama. About Tama. Oh, Tama's so cool. Wait, wait. Why does she look. Yo, she look. Um, 
Yeah. I'm not gonna go there. <laughs> I can't. Why does she look good? Getting people attracted to eyeballs. This is how it happens. Oh, she's left eye and also my partner. <laughs> Tama. Show me the news. That's not how you ask for a favor, is it? I beg of you, Lady Tama. Lady Tama. Mm. How? Whoa. I said news, not nudes. Yo, you know what needs to go happen? Tama needs to go into um Date's eye. <laughs> <laughs> I see a stupid looking man's face, like this. <gasps> How dare you? Yeah, I'll try. You'll try? <laughs> Why don't you say it like you mean it, asshole? Damn, Tama got like some like boss ass attitude. It's your duty to solve this case. This is why you're here, isn't it? I got it, Tama. You can close it. Mm hmm Oh. Uh, why oh, nice and soft. Oh my god. It feels kind of soothing. Anything, Anything to promote office wellness. What are you talking about? Well then, you won't mind if I join you. Ew. I'm kidding. I don't know, it's just... I, I, I definitely don't ship that day with boss. Wanna see it again? Oh no, I do not. No. Thank you. No, I don't want to see it. No. Too many times. What is it, Ryuki? The QR code on that sign was shown during the live stream. Today. Yeah, quite clearly. That means it was seen by people around the world. I, I can't believe I actually tried to QR scan it. They say the YouTube video and the link got several million views. The account is already deleted, but you know how it is. People upload cop that means the actual number of people who saw it is several people. Anything strange happens. What do you mean? Maybe a bunch of people being sent to the hospital after seeing the video or something. No, I haven't heard any reports like That'd be that creepy. So I see. Like I said, the uploader of the original video is unknown. Yeah, when I when I saw the um the link, I didn't know who it was either. It's all right now because I am here. Half might. Damn. Half for all. We are full time heroes. Ryuki, you a little weird. You feeling okay? Maybe we should have a doctor take a look at you. Don't worry. Fine. You're trying to convince yourself, aren't you? Holy mm -hmm. Yuki, you're exhausted. Oh, yeah, there's there's nothing to see. Okay. Boss. What? You went to a host club in Kabuki Cho after the investigation, did you? How would you do such a thing? <laughs> I mean, you usually do that. I went straight home last night. I can't be out drinking every night. I'm sorry, your kid? Yeah, my little girl. No way. At least, I think she's a little girl. I didn't spot any dangly bits, so unless she says otherwise. What? 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 What she? What she mean by? I'm not gonna question. I had no idea you had a daughter, boss. Neither did I. I didn't know either. Why'd you keep that a secret all this time? I don't think she has. It wasn't a secret. No one asked. She don't, she don't actually have a kid. Yeah, the entire country's been talking about it all day. Not just Japan, but my body sliced in half, suddenly appeared in the middle of a broadcast, and then there was that weird QR code, too. I'd be surprised if it didn't go viral. Mm -hmm. How strange. There was a blackout before the corpse appeared, right? So why didn't the stream get cut off? Huh. There's a blackout before the corpse appeared. Why didn't the screen get cut off? 
I mean, that would just mean they would were in the building and they just turned out the lights. Right? Could be. It hasn't even been half a day. Could be pewter. <laughs> Let's just blame it on pewter again. Jin's left half hasn't been found yet either. Why did his right half burst into flames like that? We're still looking into it, but I was told they haven't recovered any mechanical or electrical pieces. Mm -hmm. So it wasn't a time bomb. That's Do interesting. Do you think it could have been spontaneous combustion? Who knows? Okay then. Tama and I will continue the investigation. Oh, wait. Interesting. You so go, are they one thing I want you to be careful about. Are they trying to use Ryuki trying trying to solve the mystery in the past while Mizuki is trying to solve the mystery in the future? That's an actual interesting concept. That's very that's very smart of um Spike Chunsaw. I mean, they've done a lot of stuff like this before. <clears throat> with the different timelines, especially in, um, what was it called? Why am I blanking on the name of the games? No ordinary games, the no ordinary games, Zero Escape series. Oh, why did I forget the name? I was blanking. But yeah, they, they've done a lot of time travel stuff there. In the original Somnium Files, I mean, they kind of did, it's just different timelines. Hmm, okay, we'll see. Abyss is having issues with Ooh, it could be right something there. like they did in 999, where they had... Uh, oh, I don't want to give the spoilers away, but if if you remember, they, they had a talk from past and future. If you know what I mean, just... just... just comment on it below. Any data obtained by your AI ball can't be uploaded to the cloud. Hmm. Yeah, I can't do any backups right now. I can only save data inside my body's storage. So we'll be in, in big, big trouble if you break. Mm -hmm. yes. Any data saved from today on will be lost. Understood. We'll be careful. So, where do you plan on going first? I thought we'd start by asking around for more info. I haven't been able to talk to the people who are at the scene much yet. Mizuki, mm -hmm. Iris, Moma, oh Chihei, god. And oh god, I gotta talk to these people. You have their location. Oh no, not the square head. I don't want to talk to square head again. Yes, I've obtained each of their locations through the GPS. First, Mizuki is at a place called Matsushita Diner. Okay. Oh, this place. Iris seems to be on the campus of Sekiba High. Oh. She's not in Hito Hitomi's place? We can't see Hitomi? Makes sense. She's a student there after all. Moma and Chinpei are at the Kumakura office. Oh. Right. The Dragon and Lantern's place. And finally, Kameji. He seems to be I don't at the top amusement park at Misaton. Misaton? Do you want to ride along for the investigation, Mitch? I'm not going to work on my day off. I'm not that bored. Bored enough to come here? <laughs> there are many types of boredom. This is different. Well, Ryuki? Right. Tama, you take care of Ryuki. Always. Alrighty, okay. So we need. Let's go to Mizuki first. We love Mizuki. She best girl. No, uh, doesn't this scene? <laughs> All these scenes look familiar from the first game. I wonder what it's gonna look like. Is it the same? It kind of's the same. Is it still not doing well? Hey, what happened to his mom? Man, this sucks. I already talked my jaw off yesterday. That was with the local detective, right? I haven't heard anything yet. Big sis. Mm -hmm. Perhaps you should help them. Big sis? Ah, that's just what I call Mizuki. Who are you? And you're... My name is Kizuna. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hi, Ryuki, right? Uh... You were on that quiz show last night. I'm sorry, what? Um... I'm from the Metropolitan Police Department. Interesting. 
Alright. See something you like, Ryuki? No. I'll sell you that poster for a thousand yen. No, thank you. Why is everyone a pervert? Wow. Why did you say it like that? A window. Salt. Pepper. It says Ota's black sauce. Oh. That sounds sussy. Menu? Where's the menu? Chef's choice salad. I guess it's up to luck. Chef choice? A lot of dates on that calendar. Why not go on a date with me? No thanks. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's the reverse. We have a pervert, pervert uh, Tama, and then we have like pervert Date, and then Aiba and Ryuki are the same. Mm, what's your for man? You a man? Um, okay. Hey, Ota, does this place have fire insurance? <laughs> Alrighty. It's a stool. Mm -hmm. I wonder if Tama has an obsession with um insects as well. Autographs. Mr. Ryuki, there's a video of Tessa playing Mule Coo. Wanna watch? Uh, not really. Uh, what are you doing? Haven't you heard? I see. Wait, what happened? I keep doing why. Um, if you mount a lucky cat statue, happy nose will come to you. Lies. Kizzy, if you wanted to change the light bulbs or something, you can know him. Alright. Alright. Okay. Let's. Ooh, wait. What's this? Oh, my. You want me to smack your butt, cat? <laughs> no. Tama? I'm gonna love Tama. I'm gonna I'm gonna build an attachment. Uh, yes. hmm. I just sensed a certain elegance to Mizuki that was characteristic of an older sister. It is Not when she uses a metal woman? bite. Tama, how old is Kizuna? Eighteen, same as Iris. They're in their third year, so they're Wait, but isn't she in part of the police thing? In and she's eighteen? Is a whole six years younger than Kizuna. Oh, okay. That makes sense. I forgot that, um... Wait. Same age. Same as Iris, okay. okay. I'm, I'm thinking we're in the present time, where Mizuki is 18. I am indeed. Your uniform? Don't tell me you're a uniform buff for Yuki. I didn't take you for a pervert. <laughs> and Kizzy is good friends with Iris and Mame, too. Oh, you don't know about Mame, do you? No, who's Mame? A Mame doits her full name. She attends Sekiba High like Kizzy and Iris. Iris and Mame belong to the same dance club as I. It was through them that I was introduced to Big Sis. I was watching that quiz show live as well, then, goodness, I couldn't believe it. Yeah? The corpse suddenly appeared on the screen. Good thing the corpse wasn't bleeding. I couldn't sleep last night from the shock of it all. I was worried about Big Sis and Iris as well. Yeah, you called me a bunch, I remember. You witnessed the corpse with your own eyes, did you not? Are you certain you're okay? I'm totally fine. Your mental fortitude is admirable. <laughs> I've been through a lot is all. Yes, I most certainly do. But you said, wait, you said she's a police officer? Or no? She, she's just a student. Who said she was part of the police? Is she part of the police? Wait. Um, okay. No, I, I thought she was part of the police. Wasn't she? Wait, someone, someone said she was... Yeah, I could be imagining things. Uh, six years ago. Oh no, that's wrong. 
Um, Jin, Moma, Chen Pei. No. Eva Ryuki. Wait, who's he? Jin. Oh, the that dude. Um, interesting. So they haven't given her thing yet. She was police. What's the evaluation? <laughs> I'm curious what this does. Achievement. Competition before. Really? Iris is a far better dancer. So modest. Sorry, but I don't know anything. I just went on the show like Iris asked, and then a body showed up out of nowhere. I've heard about Jin Furue, but it's not like I knew him personally. Sorry, mm -hmm. I can't really help. Today is February 11th. National Foundation Day. Oh, yeah, it is. So, why are you here? Why else? To eat some of Ota's cooking. I brought my friend is Jiffy he... with me. Can I, I appreciate your business? Huh. And? I mean, Mr. Date is like your foster father, so I thought I'd let you know just in case. Foster father? I'm the one taking care of him. <laughs> I'm paying the rent and utility bills. No, too. You're... no way. Oh. Oh, I know of Mr. Date as well. He is quite close with Iris, so I have the honor of being on friendly terms with him as well. Yeah, Iris is like our daughter. Iris had an offer to appear on the show. So she was asked to bring another talent from Lemnus Gate, but no one could make it, so I decided to go instead. As the president of Lemnus Gate, I couldn't just turn it down. Oh yeah! President? She she owns it now. It's a long story. I ended up taking over the company after Daddy. Your Daddy. Do I remember your Daddy? Yes, I do. Are you Mr. Ota Matsushita? Oh, you heard. It's me? so weird being Ryuki and not Date. I like. It's, it's so hard. Did you talk to Date or something? Yeah, something like that. Thanks to the new Cyclops Claire clings. That's how I know his. Name and age. Ota is 24. One year older than you, Ryuki. Yeah, that's why I'm being polite. Do you have a girl? That came out of nowhere. Of course I have. No, you know, it's not Asa. You met her yesterday, right? No. Ota, not your girlfriend. Do you want me to rip your tongue out? <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, as long as we're on the subject. Oh, such relations with gentlemen are completely foreign to me. Are you into baby face guys that know how to cook? Ugh. No shame. Oh, my type is Mizuki's so us, honestly. That I am embarrassed to <clears throat> someone like Prince Charming. A prince? I yearn to be a princess. I hope my Prince Charming will appear before me with a glass slipper some. That's my dream. Okay. Okay, Cinderella. Glass slipper? Wait, 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 who is this dude? Ota? Well, he's a customer. <laughs> um well, my admiration of Princess Cinderella partially comes from that. Um, he sure. looks suspicious. Glass slippers. Is how lovely it would be to dance in them. Wouldn't it be hard to dance? <laughs> that is true. I feel like it'd be impossible to like wear glass slippers. I feel like your feet would just get sweaty in them. It'd be disgusting. Disgusting. Man, that was crazy. I said it before, but I was watching that stream live. I heard Tessa and Mizuki were gonna be on that show, right? Then mm -hmm. that body appeared out of nowhere. Man, I couldn't believe what I saw. Speaking of crazy, that ViewCube video. You saw it. No, not the whole thing. I saw the one before, though. 
The one oh? before? There, there was a one before? You don't know? A, a video similar to that one went viral. Ah, the mysterious video known as Bats 490. Yep. Yep. There was some kind of code hidden in it too. According to the rumors, whoever deciphers it will learn the secret no way. of the world. Did a grade That's schooler 90? come up with that or something? Yeah, grade schooler. Nah. Ota handles the cook. <laughs> Tama. Not at all. His mother, Mayumi Matsushita. Mr. Matsushita, can I probably in the living room back? I guess she's sitting at the Kotatsu. Oh, starts with a bunch of bats flying around. It's closed for a long time. Recently reopened, they got decent customer traffic and make pretty good amount of money. That's good. That's good. Oh, after the first game, I felt so bad for them. You know, they've been through a lot, especially with like the dad and everything. It was nice to know that they're doing well. Yes, that's where the bats. I don't know what the 490 means though. Were you able to do No way. Well, it's not like solving it would have been a big- I'll bet that secret of the world stuff is bogus and- Don't ruin the- mm -hmm. Just telling it it's just an ARG. ARG means alternate reality yeah, okay. master okay. releases mysterious information to the players decode the information- I wanna see the video. You gonna show me? Hey, Kizzy. I wanna see too. No way. Are they actually gonna do that? Don't you want to see two, Ryuki? I want to see what this Bats 490 thing is. I guess no? Maybe not? Mm. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, I've got to see this. Then I'll play some music. Just a sec. Wait, um, I have not Oh, she's better than A set. Oh, I said it. I said it. <laughs> and she's a ballet dancer? Excuse me? She's a singer too? Am I watching? <laughs> oh. Oh no, this is cringe. It's getting cringe. Creepy dude. Yeah! I, I, I'm sad. Like, I don't know what to say, man. I, I think, I think I like the first song better from the first game. I know your name. You're Kizuna, aren't you? Okay, dude, you're being creepy. But honestly, though, that 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 song was kind of cringe. You know, I don't I don't know what to say about it. Oh no! I'm sure the singer tried her very best. I heard you introducing yourself earlier. My name's Lian, Lian Twining. Twenty-two years here. old. She, he's four years older than you, girl. Step away. My father's American and my mother's Japanese. He's got the tattoos. What's this tattoo say? Dang... Dangerous? So, Dangerous. Dang what? I want you to marry me. <gasps> no. Dude. Uh, uh, 
Oh my god. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, that's faith. Huh? Um. Yeah, he did propose. Okay. I don't know who he is first. Actually, I got fired yesterday. Oh. Uh -huh. I didn't feel like doing anything after I woke up this morning. I came here so I could drink my problems away. Mm -hmm. But you were drinking non-alcoholic beer. I can still get drunk off of them, okay? <laughs> <laughs> what job did you get fired from? I was a bank clerk. What were you really? I don't like talking about it, but I was a janitor. Oh, um, I think that is a noble job. You know what? That, yeah, that is a noble job. Okay, we gotta appreciate our janitors out there. They've been, they've been doing worth the work. You're so right! But unfortunately, my job was taken from me. And I have zero motivation to do anything now. Hard work just seems so pointless. He was a janitor. There's no way he was a janitor. He doesn't look like one. I dislike people who don't work hard. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm, hitting I'm hitting up the employment, employment office tomorrow. This guy has a rather one-track mind. <laughs> he doesn't seem all that bad, though. Except he wants to propose to an 18-year-old. Well, I heard. I heard the age of consent. In Japan was 13, so well. It's interesting. No, I'm not okay. Damn dude. My heart feels like a jackhammer. Like it's gonna burst out of my chest any second. <laughs> of course this isn't a joke. He's in his dance purified my heart. There is so much darkness building inside me. But she cleared it all away. <laughs> her one dance and her singing cleared her his whole soul. Okay. It felt like I went straight to heaven. I've always wanted to be a pilot since I was little. It was my dream to fly through the sky. Kizuna made that dream come true for me. The sparkles I can't. Seeing her dance, it was like my soul pierced the heavens and flew into the stars. So, I've decided. I'm gonna marry her! Won't you marry me, Kizuna? I- I honestly wouldn't be surprised if she said yes. No, thank you. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's like MoMA! MoMA and Iris is exactly that. I'll pretend I didn't hear that. <laughs> no, thank you. I'll pretend I didn't hear that either. No, thank you. Anyway, I won't give up. You'll come around eventually, Kizuna. My motto is, if at first you don't succeed, try and fail again! <laughs> I think you mean try, try again. <laughs> try and fail again. No, we haven't obtained much useful information. There's no point in staying here for too long. Yeah, let's go somewhere else. Oh, what, wait, what is that? I was just mean, there's something new to do? And are they still not updated in the file? Isuna. Isuna, there you go. Why did I see like a police officer? I guess not. Mm -hmm. I guess there's nothing. Oh, yeah, still talk to Oda Ooh, and Mizuki. Oh, we can't. Okay. Oh, oh, yeah, I want to see the photo. <gasps> no! 
Okay. Let's head out. Um, Iris is here. Kumakura. And the department store is where the blockhead is. Minecraft dude. Steve's uncle. Steve's uncle! Um... Yeah, let's meet Steve's- Oh. <laughs> I was gonna do Steve's uncle, but I guess we're just gonna see MoMA and... I forgot his other name. I forgot his name! I started with a C, if I recall. February 11th. Wait, you're the director of that quiz show, Chinpei? Chinpei? You got a problem with that? Wait, he worked what? He works an actual normal job? No. But I told you he got out. He's making an honest living as a civilian. Oh. Ain't that right? That's nice. That's right, boss. Stop calling me that. <laughs> You're not a member of the gang anymore. I'm the altar. So what happened to like I guess I mean the story everyone knows the story of Rohan. Lined up here. Maybe mm. Moma hung them up. Wait, who's hung? Huh? <laughs> Moma? Moma's hung, huh? Oh no. Oh no. <sighs> Mama. Oh, I remember oh, this thing. Ah, oh, there's so many memories in this place. I remember because Thing was in here. What's his name? The, 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 um... What's his name? Shoshima? Uh, so Something. I just remember the old dude, the politician dude was behind there. Uh, Chinpei. Man, all the- all- everything from the first game is coming back to me. That's weird. Don't so far. So far! So far away! Anyway. And that's like a Yakuza down in here. <laughs> that's exactly what it is. Tama so smart. She's a smart girl. There's much here. Right? Okay. I think. Ooh. Oh. Ishi. Uh, yeah, I think we basically got everything. Uh, ooh, chair. Oh no, it's <laughs> just Junpei. Um, mom. Oh. I think we got everything. Uh, let's go with Chinpei in first. About the Sorry, case. I haven't found anything that might be a lead. What about the rest of the staff? They'll probably tell you the same thing. Mm. Mm. The detectives from HQ have already questioned the rest of the staff. Their reports. And they couldn't find anything. Zero clues. There isn't any information that could help. Supposed to run for six hours straight from six to midnight. But it wasn't the same contestants the whole time. They were supposed to swap out every hour. Our appearance was slated for 9 p.m. Why don't you try hitting them up one by one? The other detectives already took care of them. Mm -hmm. no clues Good thing we don't have to. There been any reports of I feel like there suspicious. might have been something suspicious and they're just not telling us. Why you left the group? A baby on the way right now. Oh, he's married. He has a baby. That's cute. So we decided to get married, but her parents wouldn't approve of it. Oh no, because you were part of a yakuza. They wouldn't let me have their daughter unless I got out of the business. I agonized over the decision. Mhm. Mm I mean, they're still family, at least, right? Two bits. <laughs> Yo, I feel that. I usually eat three slices, depending on the pizza. But 
yeah, three slices is the way to go. So I made up my mind to talk to the boss about it, but before I could. So how did you get out? Were you able to get out easily? <gasps> no way! Smart. Moma listened to Iris. Aha. What? I didn't have any ulterior motives, so don't get it twisted. Sure. I actually used to attend a vocational school to learn about filming. I wanted to be a porn director. Excuse me? Okay. I used the connections I got there to reach out to a production company for online shows, and I was promoted to director right away. Supposedly, the last director ran away, so they really needed me to take his place. Mm-hmm. We didn't have enough people. The quiz show needed three teams of two to answer questions. We tried hard, but couldn't get together that last team. I had no choice but to participate myself, so I invited the boss to go with me. And MoMA agreed to participate? <laughs> well, yeah, wait, how did he get on the game show? It was a request from one of my precious underlings, after all. I convinced him by saying Tessa <laughs> would be there, too. Then he agreed right away. <laughs> Easy way to get MoMA to do anything is just have Iris be there. I came to say thanks to the boss for yesterday. I was thinking of going to Akiba. In this place. Why Akiba? Well, um, Akiba. I need to Akiba. Stop by a Interesting how they day. both said it th different ways. I need to stop by a yeah, cafe. Yeah, it's called Sunfish <gasps> We know that place. My girlfriend works there. No way. No. Wait. Is this girlfriend who I think it is? Is it the blue hair girl that we x rayed a lot in the first game? No. Please. Wait. Girl, please. No. Really? Is it? I oh. I want to know. I want to know so bad. I hacked into it. There are a ton of videos of oh. salmon laying eggs in there. Oh. Excuse me. Why? Um. That's that's a little sus, you know. I don't. I don't. I don't like the way. See, I did do something real quick. Sorry. Mm-mm. Just want to check something. Uh, okay. Alright. I don't think that's a problem. We all have our own interests. Mm-hmm. Uh, salmon laying eggs. Moma! Come on, bro. You can't be like this. Mama. Uh, about the case. I'm pissed about the case too. That mm -hmm. cool appearance was like a dream come true. The whole show was ruined. I'd love to get my hands on the bastard responsible. A dream come true? The boss and Tessa got to shut it. Ooh, wait, what? What's happening? What else happening? The Bosch and Tessa, Mama and Iris. Anyway, I'd love to help you with your investigation. I'm just dog. testing my little emotions. But unfortunately, I don't have any info that might be useful to you. Um. Yeah, you were on the show because he asked you. Oh. So earlier, it is what it is. Okay. Yeah, yes. Take his finger oh, thank God. Oh, he needs it to raise his baby. We're not doing any of that outdated cutting off your finger deal. Mama's a good leader, you know. At least he's a good boy. Good boy, even though he looks at salmon eggs being laid, which is very sussy. After all, the Kumakuras are a gang with morals. Sounds mm -hmm. like an oxymoron, like a vegan zombie. I don't know what to tell you. Did you see any suspicious people hanging around the studio, for example? Suspicious people? Hmm. Well, I guess the only one who comes to mind is Kameji. Kameji? Yeah, Andy's Kameji, the host. 
Oh. Supposedly he has connection to the Yakuza. Oh? I'm not talking about our group. I think it's a mask. I think his head is a mask. I don't I don't think that's what his head actually looks like. That's just something I heard at a meeting with the street bosses. Word is he's involved in some dangerous transactions. No, that might not have anything to do with last night. I'm just gonna throw out ideas. I know none of them will probably be right, but I, I like I like throwing stuff out there. The Yakuza? Could it be true? Let's figure that out later. You need to gather intel for now. Got it. Then let's go somewhere else. Hmm. Yeah, what is that? Okay. Um. Yeah. Let's meet um Steve's uncle. <laughs> <laughs> Shoma, my little boy, he's in elementary school. Is he comedian? One day I wake up, go to the bathroom mirror, and I have writing on my forehead. Yeah, I think like the dot on his forehead is like a camera or something. There's no way that's him. What if? What if? He's the real Jin, you know? Like, I don't, I don't know. Maybe there's, well, hmm. I don't know. I'm making stuff up. I'm, I'm trying to think about how this game would think. And I think this character is just too suspicious for him to not be something. Something important. It must have been Shoma. He had been learning letters in school recently. Anyway, he writes Death Tub. And I'm thinking, Death Tub? Is that what he meant? Is he trying to tell me something? I don't know. I think he'd spelled wrong and then backwards it's butthead. <laughs> Then Shoma saw my face and started busting out laughing. And I was thinking, what's so funny? That's when I realized when you see Death Tub in the mirror. Oh, they spelled it wrong. Woo woo woo. Out of energy, inti, inti, no. Excuse me. I, I, think, I think they, they spelled it wrong. I wanna... Hmm, interesting. Another story about Shoma. Oh my One God. day I got a call from school and a rather heavy set vice principal told me. Your Shoma called me a pig of all things. <laughs> I apologized, then gave Shoma a talking to. Listen here. What is his face? Don't you ever call the vice principal that again? He said, Okay, I won't call the vice principal a pig anymore. But it's okay if I call a pig vice <gasps> principal, right? Wow. Okay. I say, Sure, why not? So then, as the kid is leaving, he says, I'm sorry. Can I go play with my friends now, vice principal? <gasps> Damn, dude has no chill. What is this? God of energy. Inti, inti. Pachama. Pach. Pachaka Max. <laughs> I wonder what it is in the original. Oh my god. There's like legit no one here. <laughs> Tama. Oh my god, Tama. Why why are you laughing? <laughs> um, are you finished? Well, you're the only one here. You're Mr. Ryuki from the Metropolitan. Yes. Then let's go somewhere else to talk. It's yeah, I don't trust him. Right? I don't know. Maybe because I don't trust him that he is actually trustworthy. I don't know. This game, these games make me, you know, make no sense to me. And they mess with my brain. I do not like being Wait, this close to him. Ferris wheel? Nope. Do not like this. 
do not like this. Well, why not? Alone with a middle-aged man in an enclosed space? This is not what I have in no. mind. No, thank you. And, uh... <laughs> Look! The ants are like people! It's the other way around. <laughs> Wait. The other way around doesn't sound right either. Mm -hmm. Anything else to look at? I guess not. Hey, dude. What you gotta say? Uh, you're oh, close. This? It's my one and only stage outfit. Ew. This sharp little bow tie is the highlight. My boy bow. Bow ties are somewhat unusual. Traditional ties are. But you weren't wearing that tie last night, were you? Oh, uh, I wasn't. I tend to take it off or put it on based on how I'm feeling. I don't think it was him that night. Do you come to the stage a lot? Yeah, the owner of the Mises I don't know, something, something's up with this dude. Okay. He's given me the opportunity I'll leave it for now. Several times My theories now. will be subsided. My Ferris wheel. I love Ferris wheels. I like anything that continuously spins around, actually. Plane propellers, washing machines, the beds at Love Hotel. Excuse me? There used to be rotating beds at Love Hotels a long time ago. Why are you telling us this? We're young. How do you know that? Just like life, isn't it? With its ups and downs. Rotate around the same places over and over. All the beds at love hotels don't go up and down, though. Although, I guess they do, in a way. Oh? Ew. Ex what, Tama? Excuse me? A boy is just like me. You know? Shoma? You mentioned him on stage. Yes, he really loves this Ferris wheel, too. He actually has a son named Shoma? He's almost in middle school, and he still comes here by himself all the time. Talk. With your love of Ferris wheels, I'd say you're. Talks like he's all grown up, but he's still a kid inside. Wait, wait, wait. Can I go back and look if Deathbed was. No, I can't. Okay. I think Deathbed was spelled incorrectly. <laughs> you got a point there. Or Death Tub, whatever it is. Probably. Uh... He's right in the middle of his rebellious stage, so he's been a hand. His mother hasn't been around about- Was it a divorce? Yeah. She got sick of me and left the house. Mm -hmm. Does this have to do with the Yakuza by any chance? <laughs> what? Where in the world did that come from? Just something I heard. That you have gang in connections. That's complete nonsense. Interesting. I'm just an ordinary comedian. Interesting. We got information from MoMA for. Huh. Interesting. Well, even if it was true, he wouldn't just admit it. True. Uh, I'm sorry. I have no idea what happened. I was just invited there and hosted the show as requested. Then that body suddenly appeared. Did you know Jin, the victim? I've never met him. I do know he was hated for his extreme narcissism. Why is it always the CEO? You know, in the last game, it was also the CEO of Lemnis game. If I had to guess, the motive was probably a grudge. Someone must have had a grudge against him and did that. I don't know. The way he died was so bizarre, though. I wonder if we're going to have more, um, like, bodies. You know I'm a comedian now. But when I was in my early 20s, I was working as a regular company employee. I appeared on several quiz shows on the side and ended up winning first place many times. Mm. Romandy was famous as a quiz king ever since he was a student. Okay. He even had worshippers who lauded him as the quiz god. Thinking back, that may have been the peak of my life. Adored wherever I went. Everyone buying me all sorts of things. Maybe I shouldn't have taken advantage of the situation like I did. Mm. I'm so enamored by the glamorous celebrity life. I've always loved comedy, so I strive to become a comedian. But after that, well, it's just as you saw on that stage. I wonder why 
why there wasn't an audience. It was mm. so funny. <laughs> Ah, I haven't told you yet. The producer for that show knew about me from my Quiz King days. He oh. thought I could tell all sorts of anecdotes and gave me an offer to host the show. Ah, right. Sorry for calling you Team Popo back then. <laughs> it was in the script. Didn't really have a choice. Um, by the way, Iris and Mizuki were called Team Lemon Escape. Oh! And Mama and Chinpei were called Team Yakuza. Oh, I love it. Okay, that's a cute, cute little message. Ah, does it? A little. A lot. It's more like it. Komeji's blood alcohol level is 0.12%. Oh. The early stages of inebriation. I just couldn't get over what happened last night and ended up drinking too much. I wanted to forget about everything. I had to drink. I don't know. It all seems suspicious. Sorry I couldn't help, Mr. Ryuki. I wish you luck with the investigation. I'm rooting for you. Now, if you'll excuse me. Anything to look at? Oh. I circle. Mm. Hey, there's so many things. Oh, why are we so close? It's interesting that the themes of everything in the f previous game is very, very similar. Like, amusement park, we had an amusement park in the first game, like a carousel. It, it's, it's eerily very similar. And I don't... Hmm. I don't know. Okay. I mean, let's go, let's go to Paris. <gasps> it's her! Okay, so you didn't marry her. For some reason, I thought How are uh, you Jinpei married her. Still upset about last night? But she was she was part of Sun Sunfish Pocket, right? I'm okay. I recover pretty quick from these things. See? I'm bouncing right back. Bouncy 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 bunny. How are we able to enter the school? Ryuki, would you mind hitting her with a German suplex? Later. By the way, you're and that's Mame. She's one of my best friends. Nice to meet you. My name is Amame Doi. I'm Mommy. third year at Sekiba High, and I'm in the same dance club as Iris. We talked about her. Super hyper cutie miracle beauty. Ryuki. Uh, oh, so you're the one I heard about. Mizuki and Kizuna told me about you earlier. Huh. You just pictured me in a leotard, didn't you? Uh, no. <laughs> oh, it's a pervert. Somebody call the police. Oh my god, why is she exactly like Iris? I am the police. Oh, come to think of it. You were on the quiz show last night, weren't you? Your name started with an R, I think. Yeah. Mr. Rero 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 Taro, was it? It's Ryuki! <laughs> I see. Mr. Ryuki Rero Taro. <laughs> Mame. Okay. I was hoping we could write on the blackboard. I don't understand why you'd want to start that chair, <laughs> but... I do not. <laughs> <laughs> um, want to... Oh, Mr. Teacher, I'll do anything to get an A. 
Dang, Tama. First off, that's inappropriate. Second, it could be a female teacher. I can get into that too. Damn, Tama. <laughs> oh, Tama. Okay, um, I think we're good to go. Um, uh, let's talk to a mommy first. I don't think there's anyone from our generation that doesn't know who he is. He's famous for having a sharp tongue. He used to write a bunch of completely lame articles and critiques online. He used to start up stupid internet drama crap on Twitter, too. <laughs> Mommy has a pretty sharp tongue herself. His main job was being the CEO of Music Food. I, guess, I think I read an article online that said he started the business when he was 22. But his history before then is shrouded in mystery. And no one knows anything about his childhood, right? Hmm. Yeah. He was a pretty mysterious figure. Music Food is a subscription music service and mainly focuses on Japanese music. So it's not a widely known service worldwide, but they do have 10 million subscribers. So I'm sure they make a good profit. Interesting. I was watching the live stream of that quiz show. Oh no, they're making us x-ray her like we did in Sun... Oh my god, Sunfish Pocket! Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, Tama's gonna be like, Oh yeah, let's look at her, let's look at her! And then Ryuki's gonna be like, No, this is this is inappropriate. It's interesting difference, again, between Date and Aiba and Tama and Ryuki. It's total opposite. Busy with my part time job and dance practice. Where do you work? I work as a mermaid at a gaudy maid cafe mm -hmm. called Sunfish Pocket. Is she married? Mermaids are what they call the maids that work there. They wear these cute mermaid outfits as they serve the customers. Now I know because I used to work at Sunfish Pocket a long time ago. Mommy works there at night after dance practice. I have to. Whoa, a mommy turned into a skeleton. It's an x ray. I can't believe they brought this back. Anyway, the girl does have some nice femurs. <laughs> I'd love to get inside. Femurs, if you don't know, are the marrow. bones in the thighs. What is wrong with you? Wait, what did she say about marrow? Bone marrow? Yeah. Oh, what the what the Tama? A Tama? What's what what's going on with you? Let's, let's see if they're they do anything if we do it too many times. Okay, no. I wouldn't tell anyone, but I'll tell even when you were seventeen. Yes. That's a violation of Article Sixty. Oh. Of a labor state. Though it would be the employer who would be passed. I lied to the manager about my age. Labor Standards Law Article 61 declares that you cannot employ anyone younger than 18 from 10 p.m. to 5 a.m. Oh. So according to my profile. 20 years old right now. Interesting. That's a bit. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Please don't arrest me. My mm -hmm. family's poor, so I need to keep working. One more time. Oh, yeah. Look at that skeleton. Look at beamers. Um, we're sick people. Um, I saw you know today is February 11th? Why are you here? Oh. Then why are you at school? Well, how do I put this? I just felt... Oh my god. I could never be compelled to go to school on an off day. I can only wear this uniform and attend this school for about another month or so. So I invited mommy and... I was in mommy for 30 years. My little baby Iris. My daughter. I'm sorry, I don't know anything about it. It did feel like some sort of paranormal phenomenon, though. Paranormal? Like I mentioned last night, maybe that body teleported here from some other world. The other half could have been absorbed into some other dimension. Speaking of which, there are rumors that people who watched that video and disappeared could have also been swallowed. Clickety clack, 
clickety clack. Mm -hmm. I boil the potato and my socks in a sack. What? Mr. Ryuki, are you okay? What is that? Uh, the song Ryuki was just singing was German soup socks, I think. Okay. She did. But I want to double check. Just the agency I belong to, Lemniscate, received a request for me to appear. They wanted mm -hmm. me and one more person to participate, but we couldn't find anyone with an opening in their schedule. And that's why Mizuki ended up going instead. Iris is sitting on a chair. Leering at an 18 year old. That's a bit Ew. creepy, don't you think? I was not leering. Iris is just. No. Well, what do you want me to say? <laughs> Okay. Is that all we can talk about? Hmm. There's. Is it, is it, is it... Oh, what? QR code video. A similar video went viral about half a year ago. Yeah, they keep talking about it. That's for 90 video. That's 490. Supposedly people who saw it suddenly vanished. On a seat. That's 490. He's an So, they say those who went missing were taken into another dimension. Yes, so did I. But you two haven't disappeared. Well, Iris. I don't know about Iris. That's because we haven't decoded it. There's a code hidden inside Bats 490. They say the code reveals a specific location. You have to go there to get taken into another dimension. And the people who decrypted the code all said the same thing before vanishing. Do you think that's what happened to... Jin, the victim. He was supposed to disappear, but he didn't disappear completely. And that's why his body was in half. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Like the people who disappeared actually went like six years in the future. Whoever decoded it was able to go to the future. And then this dude because something went happened, uh, something bad happened, his body was split and like half of it was able to reach six years later, but the other half didn't make it. It's a, it's a good theory. Mm, probably not plausible at all, but something. I've learned the secret of the world, but no one knows what that secret is. Mm. What the? Genny. I told you to wait for me at the gate, didn't I? Ganny? Ganny? Ganny. Ganny. Yeah, but I got here a bit early. Dude, his face looks creepy. What is up with his face? Is it like, is this supposed to be the mascot? Is he supposed to look like a mascot? His name is Gen Ishiodane. He's the owner of the fusion restaurant. He, why is he? Wait, Yorkshire. did we talk to him earlier? Oh, God. It's been a little while since I played the first part. Sure, you already know that. Yeah, I've been there many times, but why is Gen here? Yeah. Ah, if it isn't Mr. Ryuki, are you here to investigate that case by any? Yes, I was. I also watched the quiz show last night. Several people I know were on it. Mm hmm. Why are you here? I drove here to pick up Amame and Iris. I need. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. What? I need to help out at work tonight. Oh. Something came up. Uh, oh, I see. I'm free though. I can still help. That'd be great. You two are close with Gen, huh? Yeah. You're just a big old happy threesome. <laughs> okay. That was a weird way to phrase it. Yes, it was. Amame visited ramen a lot, even back when it was in Yotsuya. Once it moved to Golden Yokocho, I took Iris there. You've been to ramen too, Mr. Ryuki? Of course. I've been there several times. Mr. Date took me there. Mm -hmm. Mr. Date? So you must know Mr. Date too, Kenny. I've known him for a long time. Really? We're so close, we've seen each other's buttholes. <laughs> I, 
I, <laughs> I, I cannot imagine that. Wow, what a small world. What? Excuse me. Wait, Iris. No, don't, don't, please, don't do that. Is she really going to ignore the butt part? Okay. I thought for a second she's gonna say that. Oh, I've seen it too. That would have been weird. You're more than welcome to visit. Uh. <laughs> Jenny's cooking is amazing. Everything he makes is so good. My personally, I think his place and Matsushita Diner are competing for the number one spot. Come on now, don't compare my restaurant with a place like that. The cooking mm -hmm. there was superb when Takiro was still the man behind the chef's knife, but now it's his son Ota running things. Oh? He doesn't know the first mm -hmm. thing about cooking. Wait. Oh, Takiro, yeah, 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 Ota's dad. Dishes are missing the most important condiment. Salt. <laughs> oh, are you asking because I'm MSG? A mask? <laughs> it was fine. The security for this school is practically non existent. Wait, you actually wear a mask? There are tons of places on the grounds without any fences or security cameras. Excuse me? So you didn't walk in through the front? I couldn't have dressed like this. A guard would have stopped me. That's the reason he's always wearing the mask. You'd scare people if you took it off. I haven't seen him without a mask myself, but that's what he said. Supposedly, it's something he was born with. He got called monster when he was a kid. Oh, that's sad. Well, I think we got enough info here for now. Ryuki, wanna get going? Sounds good. Okay. Let's go! We gotta be in the car. <gasps> Please be in the car. Yeah. Oh my God! Look how fancy this car is. Yeah. I want to reorder. We're not even looking at the road. So far. Then why don't you just do it in this limousine? Oh right. I guess I. Dang, Tama, you looking good. All right. Let's do our discovery time. Let's go. Let's discover things. Uh... I guess we can't, but I guess can we only just look at her? Lady. I swear I thought something else was there. Um uh, I guess yeah, I guess lady. Uh scream like a little girl. Shut up! Stop shouting! <laughs> but you surprised me. I thought that the ghost of an SM pervert with a police uniform fetish who died in a tanning booth had come to haunt me. What? Ghost of an S and M pervert with a police uniform fetish. Haven't what I shown the? you this body many times over the past six months? I'm still not used to it. Your body is semi-transparent, and I can only see you in the left side of my vision. Mm -hmm. So, why did you come out? I thought it would be easier to talk to you this way. Uh, oh, there isn't much useful information to sort out in the. If I had to say one thing, it would be the ViewCube video in that QR code link. ViewCube. YouTube. <laughs> By the way, I'm going to cut down on the word salad and call it QR video from now on. The okay. The bit of information we got from that QR video is... You don't know? I think it was about half a year. A video similar to that one went viral. The mysterious video known as Bats 490, correct? There's a code hidden inside Bats 490. They say the code reveals a specific location. Everyone who visits that place is said to have gone missing. They all left behind the same message. I've learned the secret of the world. Hmm. Hey, Tama. Is Bats 490 still up anywhere on the internet? Yeah, I wanna I see it. it up. <gasps> oh, we can see it! Is happening. Why is the quality so bad? It may burn me. Rip me. Burn me. I 
have no idea what's okay. Hear me out. Okay. I mean, sure, I understand the video. I'm gonna disappear soon. Um, no, but that that's that those two words those those two lines really resonated. The rip me and the burn me, right? So if you think about it, the body of Jin, right? His name is Jin. I don't remember what his name is. What was the victim's name? Um I Jin, 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 Jin. Right? Same as Jin. Jin. Yeah, Jin. So, think, think about this, right? Jin, what happened to his body? He was split apart, right? One in the present, one in the future. He was, um... He was... Uh, so, rip me, right? I think that was the first line. Rip me, burn me. So he was ripped apart from like his body and then burn me like one the the one in the present time this time his body was burnt it it exploded something happened so i wonder i don't like i don't know it just it just something about that i was like that's what's happening right now they say there's a hidden message inside but i can't even tell where we're supposed to look Uh, do, 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 do. Same as the QR, it was originally uploaded to ViewCube, then it spread from there. What if... What if the deaths are supposed to be a symbol of those videos? So that... Well, okay, well, we don't know about all the disappeared people, but we know that this... This Jin person is associated, if technically, with the bats video. Then someone in the... F if someone dies by this new QR code, there's something in this new video that may be the cause of the next person's death. Maybe, I don't know, head exploding? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. The holder is unknown. In any case, bats 490 is the only lead we have right now. If we can figure it out, Maybe it'll lead to the QR video. Honestly, it reeks of bad taste. Makes me want to puke just looking at it. Keep talking like that, and I'll throw you out the window. Then you'd be a goner too. All right, let's. I'm the one driving this car, you know. Hmm. <laughs> my thing on the table elbow elbow pain all right there's a car camera to steer the car remotely i of course control the gas and brakes i send signals electronically it's technically a self-driving car okay okay fancy fancy I had to fix something real quick. Why don't you take the leap and buy a different car? I can't. This car is all I have of my parents. What? Your parents passed away. Is your parents rich? Yeah. In an airplane crash when I was young. From then on, I was living with my younger brother. But six years ago... Isn't that what you're investigating? Yeah, but remember what Mr. Adate and Iris said. For some reason, just the right half. I could travel through time and space. Hmm. Maybe that body teleported here from some other world. It's nice at laws. I know it. <laughs> Don't tell me you believe that. No, just for some reason it's stuck in my head. Oh, I guess I'm just looking at the first game a lot, and comparing some stuff. Ryuki, you have a call. It's Suki. It's Suki. I'm connecting her. Oh, Ryuki, I got your number from boss. What is it? I remembered something about Bats 490. I mm -hmm. thought maybe it could lead to a clue. What did you remember? Someone in my class at school actually figured <gasps> it out. He decoded the hidden message in Bats. He did? His name is Shoma Enda. Shoma! It's his son! He might know something, so I would go find him. Anyway, see ya! It's the- it's, uh, Uncle Steve's... Shoma. Son! 
Andy's Comages. Yeah, Andy's Comages. I gotta remember this dude's name, Andy's. Mm-hmm. And a resident. Oh, the house looks... Shoma, you know what happened last night, right? The QR code Shoma. displayed on that sign. There was a link in it leading to a video. We're calling it the QR video. I wanted to talk to you about it. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Oh, dresser. It's old. Looks like a memento for the quiz king. Interesting. This is kind of small. I'm sure Andy's is doing his best. A rooster. A rooster. <gasps> what was it? Wasn't there the Addo Rabbit? Addo Rabbit. Uh, I guess there's nothing over here. Who? What is looks like earthenware? Maybe it's some sort. Of... Was there a tatsu? Um, window hammer fan. I need to see the painting. Okay. It's a gun with a. This, this, it says, it's okay to fall off the horse. You're a saddle after all. <laughs> Wait, this was supposed to be touching? <laughs> you laugh more often than you breathe. A picture of Ame no Uzume, a goddess from Japanese mythology. Supposedly, why does that name sound familiar? Is that that sounds like an enemy from Persona 5? I think we got everything. Great. Uh, oops, remote control. Yep. You know about the video called Bats 490, right? I have a feeling it's related to the QR video somehow. You solved the code in Bats 490, didn't you? And it showed you a certain location. Hmm. I heard you went to the same elementary school as Mizuki. She's actually the one who told me about you. Just to confirm, your father is and his real name is Yoneharu Enda. Yone is that right? Haru. What are you making? Don't tell me it's a bomb. He's completely ignoring you. Yeah. Maybe because he's wearing headphones. No, it's not it. A chastity belt on his heart must be locked tight. What kind of metaphor is that? <laughs> the only thing you see is you, Vila, unless you open that lock. Excuse me? Um, so what you mean is, he probably won't speak unless you can find the key to his heart. There might be a key somewhere in- A key? It's no use. You'll have to- Mr. Co, but oh, I know it's the rooster. No, it's not. It's a broom. You, <laughs> oh, you just laughed. Little dick. Well, something. It's a clock. I wonder. I don't think. Then why don't you use the thing you always use? X-ray. What is that? It looks like a robot. I tried searching, but it looks like it's not commercially available. A homemade robot, huh? Interesting. Hey, Shoma, would you mind showing me the robot in your closet? Huh? How do you know about that? Oh, well. Uh... Tell him you heard it from Komeji. Right. I heard about it from Mr. Komeji. From my dad? That's right. Okay, then. Just for a bit, okay? Oh, how cute. You made that? Yeah. I call it Obata. All by yourself? Uh-huh. There's a junk shop in Akiba. I got all the parts there. This robot only has one tire. It uses a gyro to keep its balance. Fine-tuning it is really hard. Mm -hmm. Wow, wait! How can you 
make such a complex robot like this? Are you an alien? Or from the future, maybe? <laughs> and this form, refined yet playful. So it's obvious your sense of style is immaculate. Oh, wonderful! So wonderful! I thank the creator that I was able okay, to this, to this is like over the top. <laughs> Looks like the lock has opened. Looks like it. Yeah. Father. I don't really want to talk about him. Why not? Well, why it's embarrassing. It One of the parts for Robota, the robot running around. I want to upgrade it. I'm trying to make it so it can carry my. Cool. She's just a class. We're not friends or anything. Do you wish you could talk to her more? Uh, no. <laughs> of course not. Oh, you expression, Mizuki. Even though she's cute. That Ogo? She's not cute at all. The temperature is rising. Yeah, I can tell. Mmm, there's a crush on her. No. I solved it. No, I wanna know. I wanna know more stuff. That's 490 code. I um I have to go soon, so I'll tell you the short version. That's fine. The video's hidden message pointed to a certain look. Yeah. And where is that? Horidori Lab. The Horidori Institute of Genetics. Oh. <gasps> Are they doing experiments? I heard about it last night on the news. Truly unprecedented. What a mysterious case. I am Chikara Horidori, the director of this research institute. He hasn't retired yet. His 60th birthday was last year. Looks like a... I actually... Yeah. Mm. Interesting place, though. Ryuki, would you drink that fluid and- Absolutely not! <laughs> Why not? You might but what if I turned into a giant, green, muscular <gasps> freak? That would be amazing, you turn into the Hulk! That would be awesome. Uh... To... Okay, for... Statue... Excuse me. Is that Aristotle? That's the symbol of our research philosophy. It will take a while to explain. I'm mysterious. Okay. Uh, anything else to look at? Chairs. Do we have an obsession with chairs? Um. Okay. Uh, okay, I think we're good. Uh, about Shin. I know of him, but I haven't met him. I've only read some articles about him. On. He's the CEO of a music it's it's big. company. We have nothing in common. Jin's um, estimated time. I was sleeping in my bed at home. They say seniors are early to rise, but perhaps that means I. Is there anyone who could back your story? Don't tell me. I'm just. <sighs> Good for you. I live alone now. Unfortunately, there's no one with me at As for children, yeah. um, one daughter. His daughter and ex-wife are currently living in Italy. In other Damn. words, there's no one who can corroborate you. That's right. We mainly conduct research on gene therapy. Are you familiar with Site-specific nucleases. Genome editing is a technique that uses this enzyme to in other words, it's technology that rewrites DNA. Indeed. Last year, we developed a revolutionary genome editing method we call- With this, genetic diseases that were previously too difficult to do, for example, so, but that's not all. In theory, using purge, even Mortality. Oh, but I don't mean your buck. Death can still occur via trauma, ingesting poison, viral infections, mm -hmm. this sort of thing. However, it can make death due to old age. Of can purge really do that? Indeed. The body's deterioration due to aging can be prevented by rewriting all of its DNA. Interesting. Maintaining however, this has not yet been proven. It 
it's still in its experimental stage, but it won't be long until our hypothesis is substantiated. The ultimate dream that humanity has been yearning for for thousands of years. What do you think? Isn't that wonderful? Ah, it was mentioned on the news, but the video itself wasn't broadcasted. Then you don't know about Bats 490. What is that? It's a mm -hmm. video that's very similar to the QR video. I've never heard of it. I actually came here to ask you if there's a hidden code in the video, and I've heard it points to this research institute. I have no idea what you're sure. talking about. Perhaps someone just made it up. Ryuki, don't you think something is off about Jikara? You think so? We really are dense. You're dense enough to be the target audience for mobile game ads. Yo, that's me. Uh, mobile games can be. Fun. Most of the time, though, they take you to a page to try to force you to download a different game. It's kind of like advertising fraud. Yes, it happens all the time. There we go. Huh. His temperature is abnormal. Maybe he has the. Don't make me pluck out. Do you think he's upset? Probably. He knows. Maybe he's upset by. Like that's something. what people thought that it led to him, but it doesn't actually. Winksink. Yeah. Let's give it a shot. Wink sign. What? Sick. Wink sign. What the hell is that? Damn! <sighs> this guy. Wink sync is a simplified version of sinking. But you're still taking a look inside their dream. The dreams are made for memories, so there shouldn't be anything in there that he doesn't know about. You're saying... Chikara knows about Bats 490. He was lying to us earlier. He knows... Mr. Chikara, can you accompany me to the station? It's the simpler version of sinking from the AI ball. A strong magnetic wave is shot out to sink subjects. This is temporarily numbs the subject's brain. And puts the brain into post sleep state and induces dream. By analyzing the faint dream waves emitted during this, we can see parts of the dream. It's not a clear image by any means to investigate to more thoroughly a regular sync needs to be performed. A waiting sync can only be performed once a day because of the high amount of power required. I would need to recharge before performing again. Personally, I don't like it because of the power consumption. Interesting, interesting, interesting. What? Why? I'd like to speak to you in more detail. You do have the right to decline. Very well. I'll go with We're gonna sync with him. Sync, sync. Sync, sync. Sync. <laughs> Oh, we already put him to sleep. Hey, boss. Hi, Pewter. How you doing? I can't believe Pewter's still here. Well, I don't know. I don't remember if the final timeline, he was evil. He probably was. Uh, oh, but yes. The engineer of Abyss. Yeah, but... In November of last yeah. year, we were dishonorably discharged for reasons of Yeah, 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 exactly. Oh my god, did I like predict that? That's crazy. He made it a criminal in his escape. Exactly. I made some arrangements behind the skill. You can do that. Pewter, what? Pewter, what? Pewter is crucial part of Abyss. I couldn't let him lock him up. Okay. Normally, no. Boss has dirt on members of the executive, judicial, and legislative Damn, boss. branches of the government. You a queen. I am truly grateful to you, boss. No need to thank you. You just need to be a good little workhorse. Oh, and it'd be great if you could introduce me to some good-looking studs while- I know about- I'm counting on you. This is kind of scary. Eh, uh, you get used to- I got Thomas. The QR video seems to be the key. 
She believes Chikara is linked to the Bats 490 video. He's I think it's a bit early for that. But he said yeah. he didn't know about the video. If he's willing... I still... Ah, that's outside of my jurisdiction. So, oh. I don't know too much. I'm sure the person in charge is desperately trying. It should be... Interesting. Pewta. Um, Pewta. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Maybe. How could you go buy some soy sauce for me? What? I thought I just heard something. Ah, uh, you mean the cleaning lady? Oh, wait. What? Uh, excuse me. These TVs are sus. Wait. No. Chair wants this case is off. Okay. We what? I'll let you be my chair. Once this case is solved. Wow, what? That's... That's something. Yeah. Alright, can I look at him? Okay. Sink machine. I wonder if they made any upgrades to the sink machine since, like, the year. I gave Jakara the usual medal. Are you sure? What do you mean? I mean... Oh, don't worry about that. The higher-ups will take care of it for me. Damn! 